It's East Valley Community College showing off a brand new cool program this morning. So Desiree is live showing off the Artificial Intelligence Lab at Chandler Gilbert at Estrella Mountain Community Colleges. You don't have to go to Silicon Valley here, Des. We've got it for you right here. Yes, right here at home so we can keep all our students right in the state. They're going to get a great education uh, here at Chandler Gilbert Community College and Estrella Mountain Community College. And we have both presidents here with us this morning, Dr. Ray Rivera and Dr. Greg Peterson. Uh, first of all, tell me about this partnership and what it took to put this lab together. Yes, it was a coordination between uh, my college, Australia Mountain, Chandler Gilbert Community College, and Intel. And so Intel has do uh, donated uh, resources in terms of funding, equipment, and of course their curriculum so that we can actually offer the students for all students in the county of Maricopa. And I asked the two of you, I said, you know, are you not competing colleges? Why work together? Um, and you really had a great response to that. Tell us why. Um. So we're really able to leverage our resources in a better way to be able to provide greater access to this program across the valley. So we can, we can keep more of our residents here and build our economies here. And Habib is uh, the instructor here for within that program here at the college. So Habib, talk about the program and what artificial intelligence is. So this program is really an initiative to bring first and second year students, those who are graduates from high schools or uh, industry workers who want to reskill, to learn about artificial intelligence. But what is AI? That's the big question. It's traditional computing then reformed to be smarter. Yeah, so can you walk us to this computer over here? Uh, we'll swing around and there's photos flashing and you can see people on the screen. So for example, what is this? Um, going to be doing and how is this going to be working with teaching students? So computers don't think like we do. When we see something, we recognize, hey, that's a person in front of me, right? Well, a computer needs to learn from many examples that that is indeed a person on the screen. So think like self-driving cars. You would want it to know that there's a person crossing the road. Mm -hmm. And so it can recognize, this gives a little bounding box here, and a percentage of how much is recognized that uh, you're in the photo. And you also gave us a really good, gave me a good example earlier, and it was like, oh, okay, that's artificial intelligence. Share that with everybody. <laughs> so when you unlock your uh, iPhone with your face, you know, the face ID, it needs to know that your it is indeed your face. So we have to teach computers what that looks like. And so that's a perfect application of artificial intelligence. And for both presidents, I mean, how are you guys feeling today knowing students are getting, um, you know, top of the line equipment and programming to really go through and compete, uh, complete these programs? We're so excited to be able to provide this. This is what our future um, workforce needs. So we're really preparing our county to be successful moving forward. So excited to be here. And I'm sure the same, right? Oh, exactly. We're preparing the workforce for the future. That's, where all, that's what the community colleges are all about. Okay, awesome, you guys. So if you need more information, go to our website. Uh, we'll have it all for you there. We'll send it back to you for now. Look at so that. great. It's so exciting. I know. Look at those smiling faces. Thank you, Des.